budget breakdown. Today, Governor Lincoln Chafee signed a new state budget into law that goes into effect tomorrow. Spending plan approved by the General Assembly is designed to eliminate a $186 million deficit. But it also means you may be paying more out of pocket. The new budget adds several items to the list of products subject to sales tax, including sightseeing tours, which may hurt the local economy. We've learned the over-the-counter drugs will also be subject to sales tax. Eyewitness News reporter Stephen Schuler is live outside the State House with more and how this new budget will impact you. Well, lawmakers avoided broadening the sales tax on most items, but there are still some popular products that will soon cost you more. They're the breathtaking sights and sounds of Rhode Island, but soon taking in the ocean state's hot spots will make your wallet even lighter. I think that the tourism industry is already paying its fair share of taxes and more. Governor Lincoln Chafee signed the state's $7.7 .7 billion budget into law Thursday, authorizing a new 7% sales tax on sightseeing tours, non-prescription drugs, smartphone apps, and software and video game downloads. For someone like myself who's employed, it's difficult enough. I can only imagine for the, you know, the senior citizens and how these people are going to be able to afford it anymore at this point. Newport is one place that could be especially hard hit by the new sales tax expansion, the local tourism bureau has major concerns. Even though this is a statewide tax, we're very concerned because it's going to have a high density impact on Newport and a lot of attractions here and tours here. The move is expected to raise an estimated $17 million next year, but whether it's taking a boat tour or buying Tylenol, some think it goes too far. I think that people are willing to accept fair taxes. I think there's some question called in here as who got taxed and who didn't. I live in Seekonk, right on the line. Um, now, that you've, now that we've gone over this, I'll, I won't come back over here. There's no reason to. I'm going to pay more. And those new taxes will go into effect on October 1st. Live outside the State House with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm Stephen Schuler, Eyewitness News.